Hello fitness people, hope you all in a good work mode. As for us, we are ready to deliver you some interesting athlete training. So let's go ahead and have a look at it. This workout was designed to develop what I call functional endurance, which itself is quite a broad meaning, but in this case it means uh, it develops an ability to work on elevated heart rates, same time being able to be explosive. Here we have two pairs of exercises. Each pair has 30 seconds of cardio work and 20 seconds of explosive work. First pair is 30 seconds of upper body cardio work and 20 seconds of lower body explosive work. And the second pair is 30 seconds of lower body cardio and 20 seconds of upper body explosive. We start with punching. The initial idea is to do 4 slow punches and 2 punches blast. I would recommend to do this, but I wouldn't insist, so if you guys feel like doing blast punching is too exhausting, you can just pick up the steady pace for the whole round. Tip: Try to keep your hands and wrists relaxed, this will loosen up your moves and makes them more fluid. Also don't forget to turn your hips and shoulders as you punch. Jump Squat Cross one of those exercises that is easier to show than to explain, so I'm just gonna stay quiet and let you guys enjoy it. Skier run with Muay Thai knee. Muay Thai knee here, same as blast combo during the punching work, is optional but highly recommended. The initial idea, you do 4 or 6 steps of ski run and 2 Muay Thai knees. When you do ski run, try to open your legs as far as you can, as long as it's comfortable. So I would say 2 or 3 times longer than your normal step. Half push-ups or push-ups in the middle of the amplitude. You don't fully extend your elbows, you don't go all the way down, you just keep doing push-ups in the middle of the amplitude trying to do it as fast as possible. Knee option is always acceptable. Now let's put it all together, we start with punching. Remember, blast combo is optional, but I would recommend to do it, at least try to do it. If you feel that you're getting out of breath, you can always go back to the steady pace. Remember, when you punch, your breathing is very important, so you have to exhale every time you punch. Exhale through the open mouth. 30 seconds of punching work. And after short break, you jump straight on a jump squat cross. Try to keep your balance and exhale through the open mouth every time you press your legs. Every time you squat, every time you go up. Now 10 seconds break and get ready for a ski run with Muay Thai knee. Some people mess up with their hands here. Well, the way you move your hands here is not very important. It, it's more about balancing, but obviously you can do more of exercising if, if you swing your arms hard. 30 seconds of skier work. I do 4 steps before I do Muay Thai knees, you can do 6, depending on how tired you are, so let, the less steps you do, the more often you have to do Muay Thai knees. And without the break you jump to the half push-ups. Try to make this move nice and explosive, and remember you move in the middle of the amplitude, you exhale every time you press. 20 seconds of explosive work, and break after that. This is one round guys, you got 7 more to go, have fun!